Understanding Daylight Time, a guide for English learners. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into a fascinating and timely topic, daylight time. This concept is especially relevant for those of you in countries that observe changes in their clocks during different seasons. Let's explore what daylight time is all about and why it's important. Daylight time, often referred to as daylight saving time, DST, is a system used to reduce electricity usage by extending daylight hours during the warmer months. The main idea is to move the clock forward by one hour in the spring, often called springing forward, and then move it back by an hour in the fall, known as falling back. This practice allows people to make better use of natural daylight. The concept of daylight time was first proposed by Benjamin Franklin in 1784, but it wasn't widely implemented until the 20th century. The primary goal of DST is to conserve energy. By adjusting the clock, people can use less artificial lighting and heating, hence saving energy. It also aligns waking hours more closely with daylight hours, allowing for more outdoor activities in the evening. Not all countries observe daylight time. Its adoption varies globally, with most of North America, Europe, and parts of the Middle East and Oceania changing their clocks. However, most of Asia and Africa do not observe it. The start and end dates also vary between countries that do observe DST. Pros. Energy Savings. Increased opportunities for evening activities. Potential reduction in road accidents and crime. Due to more daylight. Cons. Can disrupt sleep patterns and circadian rhythms. May cause confusion in international scheduling. Not as effective in modern times with the advent of new technology and energy saving methods. For those living in areas observing DST, it's important to prepare for the time change. Here are some tips. Adjust your sleep schedule gradually a few days before the change. Pay extra attention to time-sensitive activities, like catching flights or attending meetings, around the time changes. Make sure to reset clocks that don't automatically adjust. We hope this video has illuminated the concept of daylight time for you. Whether or not your country observes it, understanding this concept is a valuable part of learning English and understanding global practices. See you in our next video, and keep learning!